Right, so we just finished slide 33, and let's go to slide 34. So it is again uh, very similar to the previous uh, lab using RepChat. So please uh, follow the uh, slide 34, and let's let's uh, hold on a second. Uh, here, okay. You can go ahead and then look at the 34 and 35. And interesting, I didn't put the answers. Probably uh, I didn't need to add anything. But okay, please uh, follow the lab 34 and 35. I will, I will start from the uh, clean uh, state again. Going to uh, my web class tools, and there's a web shot. I am explaining about uh, slide 34, and I just started web shot. Since it's a clean state, I'm going to make make a snapshot of registries. Then I'm going to go to the samples directory. And there is Hydrag. I'm going to start. All right, and it disappeared. Uh, let's uh, let it run for a while. Okay, now I'm going to get the second snapshot and then compare. All right. Let's see the on, let's uh, look at the question on slide 32. Observe what files are created in which directory. Since we didn't check the directory again, so you will not see anything. And not only that, we uh, on, when we use the or ones, we didn't see any actually files being uh, file being created under this certain kind of startup directories, for example, right? So for here, let's go. And could uh, were you able to see the service registry key being created? Okay. All right. And I go scroll down here. Okay. Now, when you look at it, actually, it is very interesting. Can you make diffing here? Could you? Like, no, no, you cannot. You I, I, just by just looking at this one, you couldn't, right? Because this one uh, is actually. Uh, oh, I should have not. Let me check if I have deleted or not, but I probably deleted. So apparently, basically, registry key can have actually just you know strings, or you can have uh, ASCII value in in the in the hex in the, the hex format, right? So when you see here, let's do quick. Why is it thirty six? Oh, uh, is not okay. That's fine. I have internet connection. ASCII, okay, 
36 in hex is 6, 36 is 6, sorry. Let me go back to here. Okay. 6, which is when you see up, there's a 6. And 74, 74 is probably going to be T. 74 T, right? Yeah, this is very manual, but uh, I actually, let me quick check whether I did not delete the, uh, I made just Python script to read this ASCII and convert into the actual string, but I, I don't think I actually have it. Let me check. Right, I, I, I deleted it because the previous one, I didn't have the time to go through all details, but you know what? Still, it is okay, but you can see it is in the ASCII, but how about let's use a reg edit. How it looks like. When you go to uh, this path, KLM software, Microsoft, Windows NT. Conversion. SVC host, right? Actually, it's very interesting. I'm not sure why regex read it as actually ASCII value, but when you actually use the uh, you know reg edit, you know it still has as a string. Then actually, I cannot answer the question why that was the case, right? But when you see it, you just you know you uh, can see as a string as it is, right? But anyway, well, let's see here. You see another, you know, the uh, service that is start with the res and then the random string over there, right? I'm not, I'm, uh, I'm not sure whether I looked uh, looked it up about this, you know, just you know hex, you know, uh, representation before or not. But anyway, but we can still see there's something has been changed here, right? And then we can, we could actually still verify that you know, new service has been added. Right here, and did, were you able to see the same result as I have? Right. Okay. All right. And I'm gonna close here, and let's see if something else more interesting here. This is one that has been modified. How about in the uh, in the here being created, right? Keys added, right? Were you able to see the service being created here? But the one that we saw is a, the key key uh, registry value that has been modified, right? But well, how about the key that is being created? Service. There we go. Do you see? There was uh, this, you know. Service that start with the RAS and then with the, and the four following uh, four characters, these keys has been actually created, right? Were you able to see the other result, right? Okay, any question? Good. Okay, so what we just observed is you know uh, using the uh, the dipping tool, the rank chart, we see much more details than the oral ones. Oral one case is just showed okay there's one service, but now we know more detail okay. It is a service coming from the DLL, then we can think, okay, then not only they want you know the services uh, registry key, but we know you know much more you know other even keys can be modified, right? And then but it is still related related to the only one service, right? Thirty five. So I actually asked, uh, didn't mention this one, but since we learned about the uh, registry, you know, one of the type link, right? Let's look at that one uh, in the uh, rank shot result. Okay. 
here. See, yesterday we looked uh, for this, you know, current control set. It is usually pointing either this one or three, right? And for this particular case, it says one, right? So current control set is actually pointing the control set in you know, the zero zero one. And when you actually look at the you know regression result, they are actually looking at the same you know same uh, registry key you know entries, right? So these are the uh, pointing the same place rather than these separate you know registry keys. 